In Sweden's major mineral region, north of the Arctic Circle, two very different mines faced a similar challenge, equipment that was nearing the end of its life cycle. At Boliden's ITEC copper mine, a fleet of CAT 793D trucks had reached their maximum hours of operation, but at a time when high availability was crucial. At this moment, we are looking to ramp up the production from 36 million tons of ore to 45 million tons of ore. When you work at a mine that has a 0.2% copper, it's a lot to put through our crushers every day. So we are working the trucks up to 60,000 hours. Nearby at the Malm Barrett underground iron ore mine, owner LKAB was looking at options to replace a customized CAT R2900G loader. We actually did a joint venture with uh, Caterpillar, uh, created this larger cabin with a swivel seat. So these aren't available as used machines because the only one that exists in the world are ours, as far as we know. Historically, we've always bought new machines and replaced the older ones. Two mines, two different machines, but Cat Dealer Pawn Equipment delivered one solution, a Cat certified rebuild that replaced aging equipment with like new machines at a fraction of the cost and with minimal downtime. We worked with PON for a number of years. PON contacted us and said, we can do our 2900 rebuild, which would give us the same sort of performance as a new machine. Obviously, we're very anxious to get a machine that is operational during its entire lifespan as a new machine would be. PON strongly suggested that this would be as good as new. So we decided to try, because running a, a large-scale underground mine that, that we are doing and being competitive is, is a challenge and we need to always be looking to do something a little bit better. And when it comes to cost perspective, a rebuild is something that is really good for us. So what we are doing now is we rebuild them and we get the new machine with a new identity number uh, from uh, CAT. So it's a new machine in CAT system as well. We are doing the this big CCR project for the 793 trucks up in ITIC and R2900G from LKB underground mine. So all the components comes down here, we rebuild them and they will go back for one more life. We had some, some really good support from Caterpillar and from, uh, from our previous experience with the rebuilds. We had a, a constant dialogue regarding different technical aspects and, and details of how different solutions were made and designed. And it was a, a complicated rebuild. The R2900G project was called Project Frankenstein by the, the Caterpillar guys. In the final was considered of three machines. One front from a from an old machine and a back from a new. And then we put in a brand new swivel seat cab. We did some adaptations, which we normally do in, in our workshop. Uh, we, we agreed with, with the PON to do them in their workshop. Instead, we can get a more complete machine when it actually arrives to sort of shorten down the lead time to the, getting the machine up and running. In ITIC, we got to do six in a row, so we, we have really refined our techniques. We have done a lot of planning with Bolid and to minimize the, the production impact and keeping the machine in production as long as we can and, and just taking them one by one. Everything is, is it like new. The whole electrical system, uh, all hoses we are changing. We are put better clamps so we get more mileage off, out of it. So it, uh, we have updated so it will run better for the customer. I feel really good about these trucks. Uh, actually, the customer is, is uh, really satisfied with them. And they actually look like and feel like a brand new truck. It's a new truck. The CCR trucks are new trucks for us. The operators are really happy with the new rebuilds. It's actually improving our utilization and availability. Talking about availability, it's far over 90%, 95% so far, so it's really performing performing in the top three as it should with a new machine. So this has worked out 
pretty well, actually. We have a really good dialogue with uh, Pond and Cat. And if we have some changes or adjustments to fit our operators, and uh, Pond and Cat uh, will support us and improve that for us. It was really nice to work in, in close with the manufacturer Caterpillar and being close to our customer, delivering a, a product that they value in their business. So it, it has been a, a good cooperation. It's good for us. It's good for them. It's good for everyone.